take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Yes, that's the main difference between Reborn and silicone dolls. You can feel and see that difference under your touch. Probably, it can also be easily recognized by your tiny toddler. Lifelike Reborn dolls are a bit stiff when compared to silicone dolls, which are quite soft and chubby. Make your mark, take our lead. Another reason why silicone babies are often more expensive is that they can't withstand pressure. Vinyl kits can take more during molding and pouring process while with silicone dolls, artists and companies have to be very careful. Of course, this drives the price up as vinyl dolls are more responsive in that sense. Take our lead. The cost of materials. The limbs and head of the reborn doll cost anywhere from $25 to $50 or even more. In addition, most reborns come with clothing and a blanket, which the artist will generally purchase new. Magnets for the doll and for a magnetic pacifier might also be purchased. Make your mark, take our lead. Some consumers of reborn dolls use them to cope with their grief over a lost child, a memory reborn, or as a portrait doll of a grown child. Others collect reborns as they would regular dolls. These dolls are sometimes played with as if they are an infant. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.